Less than a third of entrepreneurs in Wales are women. It is therefore important to celebrate the women who do decide to dive into the world of entrepreneurship. We attended the Top 100 Women in Business Awards to talk about this issue. There's a shortage of women in industry. There's only 2% of women at director level roles in Wales. There's only 3% of women in manual trades. Only 5% of women in engineering and 12% of women at professional roles in construction. So it's really important that we celebrate women in our community and the amazing work that they're doing. Women only attract one pence in the pound. That's horrific, isn't it? Men are getting 99 pence in the pound. And not only juggling with this lack of money, but they have these other social pressures on their time and on their lives as well. So what steps can women take to set up their dream business? Take risks and I took the plunge early on to my own business. In life is a gamble so just do it. But no one knows what they're doing so just go for it, you know. Try it, if it doesn't work, try something different. Get feedback and just sort of like do something that you really enjoy. Get money. Get money behind you. Because, you know, what happens is that people set up a business on a dream or on a whim and then they miss one payment, it could be on a credit card or one mortgage payment, and they go to, into a spiral of debt. If you change one woman's life, you're going to change a family. If you change a family, and lots of families, you change a community. You change lots of communities, you're going to change the world. Whenever there's a recession or a financial crisis, women and girls are the first and young people to get hurt. So I think it's really important that we put more projects in place to really boost young people and help more women and girls to start up businesses and create new enterprises.